red hand at the back. So let's take a look at it from the side, the lead side, right here. And what we're going to be working on, of course, we're going to keep this, we're going to get to our offense. We're going to keep this 52 block related, shape related. So the first shape we'll be taking a look at, of course, is one of the most famous ones, which is skull and bones. So let's get our skull and bones together because a lot of times I'm seeing this, 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 and you know, all types of, you know, strange shapes of skull and bones. So I'm gonna give you an easy way to get your skull and bones as an orthodox fighter. Lay flat. Here, wrist to elbow, sit down, see it. See this look around the corner thing. It's like the man looking around the corner. So that you know what your skull and bones doing is obstructing your view. So where you can't see what's happening. You know, when when your when your view is obstructed, you've went from blocking to covering. And we're not knocking covering. We're not saying that covering can't work. The covering is exactly when you're kind of like you can't see. You don't know what's coming, but you're just trying to stay protected. Your lead skull and bones. As of now, once again, I'm, I've turned south off. The lead hand lays down. Rear hand, wrist to elbow, slant. So let's get it. Let's get about ten of those. Move past our training wheel stage. Don't we taking the training wheels off? The training wheels are gone. We're going straight into it and sitting down. And then always coming back to our neutral stance, people. Do not get caught up in the in vogue in the 52. We are not voguing. We are not voguing here. It's not the dance. So, as you sit down, come right back in the neutral. This neutral is where you want to learn to start launching your attack right after you finish. Bang, you want to be able to launch your attack right here. So, that's what we'll talk about right now, too. As we add on, we're gonna add on to that drill before we finish. Is the ability of making fists. Now, as simple as this sounds, a lot of people are confused. They're doing all of this tiger, trying to do monkey paw, crane beat, and all of this. No, no, no. Look at this. Take your hand, close it. See what the gun does? It locks away the two punch knuckles. So comfortable with it. Put a little hot sauce on it. You put a little sauce on it. Three. Two. One. One more now. Let's get this work. Let's see our finished product. Before we come back to our neutral stance, one hand up, one arm going for the punch. 